Hi, welcome. Thanks for joining me. On this episode of Build Drone, what we're going to do is we're going to take a detailed uh, look at this 2018 Roush Jackhammer Mustang. Now, yesterday, yesterday, I did the, the configure. I did a build in price. So I'm putting a link up right now so you can get over to that. If you want to see me build an option one of these out and do all and do everything, I've already done that video. All right. Subsequently, uh, this this car is a 2018 uh, Mustang GT, right? 5.0. I've also done that video as well. Uh, so build out, build price and option a 2018 Mustang 5.0. I'm going to put that link in the description of this video. All right. So with that said, let's just take it. So in this video, because I all I did yesterday was do the configure. So in this video, what I want to do is I just want to go down this page and just take a, a more detailed, more, I guess, a closer look at at what makes this you know what makes the the jackhammer a jackhammer so the base price of this thing or the pack the price of this package is fourteen thousand seven hundred and sixty five dollars right that's above the price for the vehicle right you've got to have a you've got to have a 2018 mustang 5.0 right mustang gt right and then for an additional fourteen thousand seven sixty five you can have this roush package applied to it and then there's more options that's why it says starting at because there's other options but that starts at that but you gotta have the car as well alright so that's the highlight on that and then down at the bottom of this page we'll be able to see what's all included for this fourteen thousand seven sixty five right it comes with seven hundred and ten horsepower that's the five liter engine and then after the supercharger install it bumps you up to 710 horsepower. This is not just a performance thing, right? They give you a five-year uh, powertrain warranty, five-year, 60,000-mile powertrain warranty. Looks like there's a clickable link right here that you can go and find a dealer to connect with so you can get one of these because they are hot. I mean, I could definitely have one of these in my garage. I'm sure you probably could too if you're watching this video. All right, so uh what else there's not much to go down on this page but i did want to take a closer look so drop the hammer jackhammer is proof of roush supercharging capabilities match with unprecedented styling for the 2018 model year mm -hmm. uh between a road car and a race car is a roush car that's a quote i guess from jack roush uh new for 18 the jack uh, the roush jackhammer is a special edition to be supercharged to be supercharged mustang Built from a Mustang GT, the Jackhammer takes the hard work out of supercharging by installing the components buried deep in the engine bay, as well as machining the front engine cover before the vehicle leaves Roush headquarters. Supercharger installation will be completed at delivering dealership uh, with the new for 18 Roush TVS 2650 supercharger unit to unlock the Jackhammer's full potential. I would assume, though, and I did read this, I know this from yesterday from doing the configuration video from yesterday uh if you already own one and you go to roush then they'll just go ahead and do the whole thing you, they're not going to have the dealer finish it up if i just had a 2018 uh mustang gt and brought it to them they'll do the full install but what i do know is that the cost goes up like you know like another sixty nine hundred dollars or something like that if you just brought your vehicle in i talk a little bit more about that in the configure video all right, um, let's go back and pick up where we left off. I think we were right here. Supercharged jackhammers are boosted to 710 horsepower. Plenty of power to tear it up on the street or track, and that's for sure. Uh, they're only available in fastback. You can't get it in a convertible. Uh, you can get it in a six-speed or a ten or six-speed manual or ten-speed automatic. Very cool. Very cool. The thing looks super sporty. I mean, it looks sporty, and more than sporty, it looks tough. I mean, it looks genuinely tough uh what are they going to tell us about the exterior uh they feature the jackhammer features several unique visual identifiers that separate them from stage one and two mustangs including the coveted hockey stripe right here uh distinction a marking that it has in the past only be granted to stage three mustangs i actually did do the stage three mustang from 2017 build as well i have a playlist should put a link up i have a playlist to all the roush vehicles i've actually done all of them so check that out i've done the stage 3 2017 roush uh mustang uh equipped with roush's adjustable suspension and new ultra high performance 
uh, Continental Extreme Contact Sport tires, the Jackhammer, provides levels of performance normally reserved for supercars. I bet that's right, too. I bet you this thing throws down legit. Uh, Jackhammers can also be equipped with our new optional matte black top performance stripe. When this option is chosen, the hockey stick graphic will also be applied in matte black with a choice of accent stripe color for all graphics, right? And here are the colors, I guess. Matte black jack, Sin City silver, performance pearl, and red-blooded American. Uh, I just, I, I love, I love the names of their colors. Uh, additionally, Jackhammers are the only Roush Mustang to have standard gloss black wheels. New for 18 model year, these black wheels give the Jackhammer a sinister appearance. Yeah, you know, you do one of these in black. I mean, it looks good in this. Uh, this looks like this might be red-blooded American, this color. Um, but you do this in black with those black wheels, and that'll be seriously sinister. So let's see what their promise is. Uh... At Roush, it's not enough to just deliver uh, ground-shaking performance and unparalleled refinement. I like that. I like that because I want refinement as well. And race-inspired styling, also like that. I mean, I expect this. I expect hard-pounding performance when you're talking about cars like this. But I, I really really like this un I like the refinement because I don't want it just seem like it was cobbled together in a garage and I love the race inspired styling I like it a lot so they take it a step further though uh, they back it up with that uh, industry leading five years 60,000 mile limited powertrain warranty uh, so for more information we can download this guy it looks to be a clickable link uh, and I'm gonna go ahead and download that and I guess I'll I can put that link in the description so that way you don't even have to get back over here I'll just put it and I guess they go into the details of that so they also say that their vehicles are rigorously uh, engineered and tested to prevent issues down the road but should they occur guess what they got your back basically is what they're saying all right so here are the core components now now these core components is what makes up this 14,765 okay this is the core components right you get that prepped for 710 horsepower supercharger package, under the hood preparation, including engine machining, uh, lower temperature, uh, radiator system components, uh, and, and, and a bunch more, I guess, installed at the Roush headquarters. Uh, you get that uh, the fifth, five year, 60,000 mile limited warranty. You get extreme half duty shafts. You get those uh, exclusive black wheels, right? Only found on the jackhammer right as standard equipment it said right it says the roush mustang to have standard gloss black wheels so it gets those standard gloss black wheels they're called ebony black cast wheels uh and they only they seem to use these tires across everything right uh continental extreme contact tires and then they this comes with the performance one-way coilover system but that's even though it's a one-way it is height adjustable uh jh we have to assume stands for jackhammer uh strut tower brace uh, high flow upper grill uh, badge, high flow lower opening, uh, front chin spoiler with wheel shrouds, front arrow corner pockets, hood heat extractors, Roush fender badges, uh, the Roush jackhammer graphics package. That's that hockey puck stick package, right? We You can see that right here, right? All that. And then that takes us over here. Body side scoops in body color, low gloss black rear deck lid spoiler, Rear blackout panel with Roush badging. Um, Roush front windshield banner. I think those look cool. I'm normally not a fan of that stuff, but on this car, it just looks really cool. Rear valance arrow spoils. Uh, hood strut lift assist. Jackhammer serialized engine bay plaque. You get the license plate frame. You get an interior medallion on the dash. You get embroidered floor mats. You get illuminated door sill plates. And they also, there's that owner's guide again to, to be downloaded that I'll put in the description uh, optional components right optional components is a complete system uh, installation and that's available for post title builds right if you are getting this car uh, brand new at the dealer then this is the setup right this is the setup if it's after the fact then they do it, and I think it's like an additional $6,900 or something like that. I know, like I said, I go into it. I think I said it before. I go into it in this configure because I like had to figure it out. 
and so they kind of have a little more documentation on the configure side on how that how that's set up uh and then you can get what uh quad black tip performance exhaust system is optional their active exhaust system is optional that's where it's got like just like you know you get from the factory with sport touring and race modes for your exhaust uh performance stripe is optional it's got the three-way coilover suspension that's also height adjustable that's optional you got the billet performance pedals uh those are optional uh the leather seating so whether you get the base seats or the recaro seats you can get it the leather seating option uh you got a six-speed shifter ball those look really it looks really cool uh You've got the Roush Design Instrument Gauge Cluster. Uh, you got a trunk-mounted tool kit, which looks pretty cool. I think you should get it because it helps with the whole experience. you got to get the whole experience. Uh, quarter window scoops painted black only, and then locking lug nuts. So that's all the optional stuff. And then I think that's the end. There's just a picture of a young Jack Roush here with some humongous pork chops over here. Didn't they call them pork chops or something or Cadillacs? Or pork chops, I think they were because they're huge. Anyway... That's that. Now, that wraps up this overview. Like I said, I also did the configuration build, and I also did the Mustang GT 5.0, so you can see how much it costs just to put one of those in your garage. If you found this video helpful, entertaining, or both, please like, share, and subscribe. I'd really appreciate it. Thanks for joining me.